Okay, in this short video, I'm going to be showing you the solutions for Code.org Lesson 6 Maze Loops. Starting with number one, it's showing you how to do this without using a loop first. So you've got to get the bird to the pig. You're going to move forward one, two, three, four, five times. Number two. Same exact um, problem to be solved, only this time you're going to use a loop block and you're going to move forward five times. So you can see how it shortens the, the code writing. That's the solution for number two. Moving on to number three. Again, get the bird to the pig. We're going to still move forward, only this time we're going in the vertical direction five times moving forward. Number four, <clears throat> this time we're going to have two separate loops. One's going to move us forward four times, and we're going to turn right, and then we're going to do another loop to move forward five times. Number five, move forward, turn right. In a loop, we're going to move forward five times. Number six, we are going to create a loop, and we're going to turn right and move forward twice, and we're going to repeat the whole thing three times. Number seven, we're going to have a loop that repeats five times. It's going to move forward, turn right, move forward, turn left. By repeating five times, you will zigzag all the way down through the maze. Number eight, we're going to create a loop that repeats itself three times, and inside that loop, we're going to create another loop that goes three times, moving forward, then turning right. By doing so, you work your way around to the flower. Number nine. Again, here's what we're going to do is we're going to create a loop, and we're going to put a loop inside of that loop, moving forward and turning left five times. Let's run it. Once that loop is done, it moves on to the next loop, which repeats three times. in order to move forward and turn left. Moving on to number 10. Number 10 has a loop that repeats itself two times. We're going to move forward twice, turn left, move forward twice, and then turn right. Number 11. We're going to have a loop that repeats itself three times, moving forward twice, turning left, moving forward once, turning right. Number 12. We're going to have a loop that repeats two times. We're going to move forward twice and turn left once. Number 13 was a multiple choice. The right answer was right here, where you want to repeat three times. Okay, you want to turn left to set them straight, move forward, turn right, move forward. Number 14. This was a matching. So in this case, we want to move forward, turn left, and then we have a repeat block to get our bird all the way up to the top. Then we turn right and move forward. Next one, we move forward, move forward, turn left or right, move forward, move forward. Last one, we're going to have a block that repeats three times, moving forward. Then we are going to turn left, move forward, turn right, move forward. Okay. And that's all there is for lesson number six, maze loops.